I'm Terry Longmore, um, a strength and conditioning coach here in London. Um, I'm from Washington, D.C. I'm here to bring a lot of flavor to training, a lot of excitement, and a lot of results to the people of London and across the U.K. What is your academic background and why did you choose this field of study? My academic background is psychology um, and I chose this field of study because psychology as well as physiology work hand in hand. Especially in the field of sports, there is no such thing as a good sportsman and he doesn't have control over psychology. What are your core principles for training someone? Our core principles are very simple. We assess, we correct and we perfect. So we assess the individual to make sure that through their biomechanical assessment there are no deficiencies um, in their physical composition and we correct those things to make sure that they can go on in their daily lives without any sort of injuries and as well as we try to do a sort of like a pre-injury prevention sort of thing in our training methods. And we perfect everything we do, we try to be perfectionists and we make sure the individual walks away from our training methods or our training sessions in the best possible shape. Why are you better than your competitors? What are your key differentiators? One of the biggest things about training the Terry Longmore way, uh, our methodology, is that we've got to have personality. It's all about that attitude, the energy. We bring that energy into every session. A person walks away from our sessions and they feel like, wow, that was fantastic. It was dynamic. It was awesome. But at the same time, they are getting results. So it's beneficial to come into a session knowing that you're going to get all of those things and still walk away with a great smile on your face and in pain. What was your bringing like and how do you harness that into your work? Well, I come from a sporting family. Um, everyone ran track in my family. Uh, even my sisters. I come from a big family. I'm one of seven, uh, two, five boys, two girls. My sisters ran track. My brothers ran track. Um, and I just sort of gravitated into that, being one of the youngest kids of the family. I harness it into my background simply because I live a sporting life. I come from sports. I am sport. I live it, eat it, eat it, and I breathe it. And so it's easier for me to amalgamate that into my training methods. So that energy that we bring to training, it, um, it resonates based upon the fact that I grew up in a sporting environment all my life. What are the biggest challenges that you face in training someone and how do you overcome those? Well personally as a trainer one of my biggest challenges is taking someone who has low confidence and low self-esteem. Um, and that could be for a number of reasons. Um, whether it is a housewife or it's a professional woman or a professional man who is an executive or what have you, if they don't have a lot of self-esteem or confidence, that basically means that they don't view themselves in a high, sort of in a high level of, um, uh, they don't view themselves very highly. And so therefore, when they come in front of me, they're a different person. In front of their colleagues, they're brilliant. In front of me, they're no different than a 12 year old. So my biggest challenge is trying to reverse that. And that's where the psychology comes into it. And making sure they receive their, they, get, they get their results. And making sure that when they walk away from every session, they look forward to the next session. That's a big challenge, it's huge. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm Terry Longmore and the concept behind Terry Longmore is to correct oh, stop. I'm Terry Longmore and welcome to TerryLongmore.com. You want me to say? What do you want me to say?